Hey guys, Dark Silk here. Just uh, thought we'd play a little bit of Valis. Now, I'm on chapter 4. I've got the first three keys. And these keys come from whenever you explore your house. That when you go through that door where all the fire is and everything, you're actually unlocking new memories. Uh, I'm missing about two and a half hours of gameplay from the last video you saw. Uh, let me tell you what the story up to this point is real quick. In the last one, I was trying to find the oysters and the singing fish and all that stuff for the uh, wars and the carpenters so they can do the play. Well, I got them all together, and then I found out that they had already killed half the town. There's fish bodies everywhere hanging. It's really disturbing, very, very graphical. You guys probably would have loved it. Sorry, I couldn't get any footage of that. Uh, you get to the play. All the rest of the fish people are in there watching the play. It the Oysters dance out, Warris jumps on stage, kills and eats them all. And Carpenter sits there and talking about the poetic justice of the whole thing. You wake up in town where the uh, you're in a wagon. The guy who knocked you out and last time you are in town, he's uh, unconscious on the ground being arrested and the whorehouse is being burnt down. Well, you go to your psychiatrist and then you pass out again and you're in this area, which is was one of my favorite areas. It's kind of oriental theme to it. And you go and try to find the caterpillar. Well, throughout the whole area, there's these wasps and ants that are attacking each other. The ants are like the good guys. The wasps are the bad guys. Well, you uh, attack a bunch of wasp creatures, which are really cool. It's kind of like a samurai wasp and stuff like that. Uh, when you finally find the caterpillar, it turns out he's in a cocoon. And at the very end, he morphs into a butterfly. And then you wake back up, and that's where I am right now. I know I pretty much cut that out or simplified that story to its basics but that's the best I can do in just a few minutes time I found this little thing right here where you can actually show your weapons rotate your character around and zoom in I've upgraded the Vorpal Blade to the max level the Pepper Grind to the max level that looks like a Razorback right there that's pretty cool especially since I'm from Arkansas and our team is the Razorbacks uh, Hobby Horse is still level 2, and then I got this Teapot Cannon, which I'm not too sure about yet. Uh, it's really, really hard to aim this stupid thing. <laughs> Alright, well, let's start play the game and play some Alice. I am in the woke up in a police station, of all things, and it should be interesting. Alright, looks like I skipped the part where I woke up. Alright, a uh, quick thing is I woke up in that cell right there. This guy right here let me out because last time I stayed overnight for being, well, crazy... The psychiatrist came, chewed him out, and threatened to have his job. And this guy right here is just being uh, kind of a weird little dude. Alright, now I decided to stop here because, well, this would have been a great time to start videotaping again. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Homeless dude over there. Uh, huge ass blood stain. Are you alive? Yeah, he's moving. Hey, copper, uh... Something's not right over here. Seriously, you might want to come check him out. Alright, moving on. Wow. What's up? How you doing? Game blow? No? Alright. Let's see. And you can't jump on the real world. Oh, it seems like there's three levels of world every chapter. You got the real world, you got the Wonderland world, and you got each Pacific character world. And that's where the costume usually changes. So it's like three stages, I guess. Let's see. Charges. This is my day off. Oh my god. Look at this the woman right here. She actually looks normal. I mean, have you seen all the horrors and stuff? Like, well, this woman over here. Sign out all funky looking, can. big ass nose, wrinkly ass breast. Compared to this woman. Well, if I can get a. No, I can't get a good angle. But look at her. She's almost normal looking. She's got a deformed little dwarf for a kid, though. Alright, what we got going on over here? Ooh, it's the white kitty. Hey, come back. Where'd you... Whoa. Whoa, I just passed out. <laughs> Alright, what's about to happen? Whoa. The world's all kind of crooked on me. Alright. Ooh, I feel like I'm playing some kind of dungeon game. Alright. Oh, I am in a dungeon, aren't I? <laughs> Look at this. Hey, what's up? Getting a little touchy-feely there, aren't you? Uh, apparently, I can't talk to these people. I wonder if I'm back in Wonderland. Oh, wait, the Queen of Hearts. I bet I'm in her area now. 
I say as soon as I find a passageway that's shaped like a heart. <laughs> oh, it's all bloody and stuff too. What the hell? Oh, there's tentacles. Seriously, am I in Japanese anime school? If she's in a school dress and there's tentacles involved, I'm just quitting this game right now. Whoa. Cutscene time. That's a big ass tentacle. No, seriously. I, I ain't into that. No tentacle play. Ugh. The thing was pulsating. You guys ever see Hellraiser? That scene right there looked a lot like the one where the chain and hooks were stretching them across the area. Actually, it looked similar to Supernatural, one where Dean went to hell also. Okay, I'm in just my regular Alice dress right now. And this is definitely in the Queen of Hearts area. Are uh, you serious? <laughs> oh, this whole thing's going to be nothing but jumping puzzle. Great. Oh, if you want to see that teapot in action, what it does is you charge it up, let it go, and it shoots it out. If you notice, I'm actually aiming at the two of clubs here. Watch where that stupid thing actually goes. What? Oh. And it knocks you backwards. There's there's that. <laughs> All right, let's see. Ooh. It's actually spitting cards at me. Cool. All right. There we go. Yeah, this ain't going to confuse me at all. Okay, how do I get over there? That's out. Okay. Are those stars off in the back distance? Or maybe more teeth? Because there is another floating thing. Where'd it go? You can just barely see it. I don't know if I can reach it from here. I might need to actually travel a little bit. Because there is that two over there. Alright, let's head back. There we are. I've got a little bit better at jumping, but now that I said that, I'm probably going to really screw up or something. Alright. I've been having trouble with uh, my sound being slightly off from the video. Problem is, there doesn't... S Ooh, there's a pig snout. It's an actually invisible one, huh? Problem is I don't really have much choice with this game because I can't run it and a audio thing at the same time. In my fear game I think I can actually run a separate audio track so hopefully they'll keep the uh, voice and gameplay in sync. There we go. So apparently I need to learn how to talk and play at the same time. <laughs> Memory time. Claimed I'd stolen his heart. Trifling with his affections. Creepy sod. Touching me. Told Papa to never invite him to tea again. Ugh. Oh, uh, part of the storyline was they're trying to make it sound like Alice Star the Fire. But as she explored her memories, it, I'm starting to think maybe her sister was actually the one that started the fire. Maybe someone was actually molesting her. Did she started the fire? I don't know. We'll see. Whoa, jump. <laughs> Almost made a boo-boo on that one. Wait, there you are. Ah, stupid thing keeps disappearing on me. <laughs> Fuck it. Uh, well, at least I landed exactly where I fell. There's always that plus. Oh, okay, that's cool. Miss. Okay, so my jumping needs some improvement. There we go. Got it. Alright. Did I miss anything out there? Yeah, there's a yellow tooth over there. And. I don't exactly see a way to get to it, though. Hmm. There doesn't seem to be any blocks or snouts or... There's a snout. Yeah, these invisible snouts can suck. 
Alright, there we go. Okay, let's do this. This. Two Ace of Hearts, someone's cheating. Five Ace of Hearts. That is one heck of a five of a kind. Get on there. That's why I really want to do is play some poker. I love uh, Texas Hold'em. Whoa. Stop moving. Stop that. What, what? She's moving by herself, guys. <laughs> Hold up a second. I think my keyboard got stuck. Uh, I'm going to pause the video while I try to fix this. Alright, there we go. It's, I'm not sure exactly what caused that. Oh well. Uh, let's look around here. This is cool. I wonder if there's any secrets running around. Oh, whoa, there's that. It just shows teeth though. Maybe those blocks are destroyed. I wonder if they're going to do like a card maze I gotta fork my way through. That'd be kind of cool. Don't jump in that. Let's explore a little bit. More blocks. Any of you guys ever do origami where you actually fold the paper into blocks like that? I think at school we used to call them balloons or something. Alright. I always try to head the obvious way last. Okay, there's those blocks. If I step on you. Oh, that opens up. Oh, I think this is going to be a timing puzzle or something. Alright, let's come back to that. Explore everything else first. I go through that to get over there. Get these teeth. Hmm. Alright, I think I have an idea of how to do that one. Oh, there's another... Oh, I see what that does. It lowers that platform down. Okay, and it'll do that. Hmm. Let's run over the other side. Drop a horse here. Run the or a rabbit. Run over here. See what's up. Okay, cancel that. Let's go see what's over here first. Ooh, I can actually go through there. Instead of keyhole, there's just a. Whoa, that's weird. Okay, another memory. Light, light is useless if what it illuminates causes pain and suffering. Better to cast such things into the dark depths of Lethe, the river of forgetfulness. Okay, so it's better to forget than learn from your past mistakes, according to him. All right, let's see. Okay, what I want to do. Just place the rabbit here. That should lower that platform over there. I want to run over here. Maybe over here? No. Okay, I see where it raised the platform. I don't think I can do this fast enough. Oh, I got stuck. Nope, not fast enough. Okay, that door over there actually stays open quite a ways, so... Quite a while, I mean. All right, let's do this real quick. Oh, I do got a dash. I forgot about that. <laughs> there we go. Step on you. Run over here. Dun, 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 dun. And jump blindly. And I missed. Whoa. Okay, so don't jump blindly again. <laughs> uh, how did I that? I jumped right over that stupid thing, didn't I? Okay, so. The leap of faith didn't work out too well. That's what I get for watching Indiana Jones. Go. Speaking of Indiana Jones, how many of you are waiting for the Uncharted series? What is it, Uncharted 3 to come out? I'm so looking forward to that thing. Oh, I'm not going to make that, am I? Nope. <laughs> okay, I'm going to have to figure a way to do this a little bit quicker. Hmm. Oh, duh. While I land on the platform, I need to blow it up myself manually. That will buy me an extra second or two. And not missing that jump would have helped out a lot, too, I'm sure. Oh, I think that actually slowed me down there. 
Okay, it's a double jump. And I walked off this side. Okay, this could be one of those annoying jumping puzzles, which I'm really, really good at. Sarcasm, kids, learn it. Right, let's try this one more time, and then I'm going to pause the video until I get it right. <laughs> Okay, quick little F. There it is. Jump. Explode. Rise up. Where you at? There you are. Go. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Shrink. Get under it. Yes! See? See? That's how it's done. Alright. Here I'm bragging about getting it done. It took me, what, five tries? Six tries? I can't really brag unless it gets it done in, like, one try, right? I'm loving this area. It's kind of a pain to figure out with these cards <laughs> appearing out of nowhere like that. Holy! Olé! Oh, that was tripping. Okay. Fling me up again. Oh, I missed. Oh, where are you going, stupid? Did I miss that one up there? Got it. There's one what I can't get those. All right, let's head this way. I guess two or three teeth missing isn't gonna be much. Man, there's teeth everywhere. I'm not getting. I don't even know how to get those. Okay. Well, that's what that does. All right. Uh, rabbit. Go, go, go. Yeah, there you are. You and Whew. <laughs> that was close. I didn't really need that rabbit, I guess. Alright, you go that way. Wait, there's a bottle out there. There's a pig snout. Where was that? There you are. Even invisible though, your uh, circle or your aim target device I guess will still glow red so you can actually find them pretty good oh ho 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 that was wrong oh why aren't they giving me so many jump puzzles for give me some actual just stand still and fight type things or fighting on flat ground there we go you know, I even go with the fighting in 2D like they had me doing last time. I'm serious, man. That last one, they actually had me going two-dimensional. It's kind of weird. Alright. Made it through. Hoo -hoo. Okay, there you are. Ooh. I hate it when they skip like that. <laughs> okay, well, I, at least I know how to get these teeth now. Oh, it's a sliding thing. Woo, right, uh... Where do I go? That's where I go. I don't know. I... Duh! Didn't think I was gonna make that. Uh... Where'd you put me at? Oh, there I am. Alright. Gotta go through all this fun stuff again. Just let me start sliding. There we go. Yeah, I should be able to make this one now. <laughs> there we go. Okay, looks like I'm leaving this area. wonder what kind of costume I'm going to get. And I'm going to take a quick drink. Oh, there's my costume. One sec. And no, I'm not actually drinking alcohol, I'm drinking Gatorade. Fierce Grape is one of my personal favorites. Uh, she's all red and... Hmm. This looks kind of weird, actually. Ah, camera, stop. That looks pretty cool, I like it. She actually has a skull shaped like a heart on her back. <laughs> yeah. My favorite is still the underwater dress, but this one's not bad. Alright, let's see where it leads. 
sliding puzzle. Alright, if this thing splits off in different directions, I might have to go back. Fall down a couple times on purpose, because I want to get all the uh, teeth that it has on it. And the last time I was on one of these things, it took like five different tries to get them all. If you notice, when you break those things, it seems like it's gives you yellow a few times. Alright, we're going this way first. Now. Okay, you can stop burning yourself. Okay. Yeah. Alright, jump. I'm going to just hover over these stupid fire things. And I landed right on top of that one. Okay, this is what you do not do. If you want to succeed at this game. Well, I hope I get some hearts soon. I've like lost half my Oh, slow oh, I missed all of those, didn't I? Alright, I'm still doing that again. And now I'm taking the left path instead of the right path. Swinging key. Okay, here we go. Oh whoa, whoa. They actually Yeah, I actually lost all my progress on that one. That's weird. Looks like it's not going to let me do it like I have in the past. Well, that's lame. Seriously? Alright. Uh, well, <laughs> looks like I'll actually be completing this legit for real. Alright. Uh, just go the way I went last time, I guess. As long as I avoid... Yeah, I'm actually avoiding them a little bit better this time around. There we go. What do these things look like to you? Like little pus pockets or something? Maybe cocoons for eggs? Alright. Let's see if I can pull this off. Yeah, there we go. I just bypassed all those stupid things. Oh. <laughs> wow, I totally lost control there for a second. Alright, jump. There we go. Wow, that got really, really foggy. Whoa. The, uh, slide's gone. That is really tripping. Alright, let's go. Ooh, little cutscene. Anything? No, I guess she's just looking around. Ooh, Chessa. Back to admire your handiwork, returning to the scene of the crime. It had to be done, Cat. You said so yourself. You and this Red Queen cannot both survive. She is a cancer in your body. Excise her or perish. Well, she was the face of evil in the heart of darkness. She didn't treat you too well last time. Lost your head, as I recall. She was completely deranged. You picked up her crown, but now you've put it down. You must speak to her. What's left of her, anyway. You know, scenes like that that makes me want to play the original game. <laughs> I so wish I knew what... Oh, that's creepy. I think I might actually try to find some videos of the first game somewhere and watch it. Uh, let's see. Okay, I wonder if this place is going to just sit there and collapse around me. Hello. Looks like there might have been secondary. Blah, blah, blah. Learn to speak English. Secondary path. Or I may have collapsed and been the original path to begin with. I don't know. Go. More of that weird fog stuff. Love getting yellow teeth. There's a memory or something. Ooh, I get to fight. Yeah, get over here. 